statement to make. Yeah. Would you not like to make a statement? Mr. Speaker, I was honored to work with this finance minister to develop the largest capital plan in Alberta's history. Together, we invested about $30 billion over four years to stimulate and diversify Albert, Alberta's economy. This year's budget is a testament to the strong fiscal management the UCP has brought to our great province. Budget 23 is investing over half a billion dollars in Calgary LRT projects, nearly half a billion dollars to upgrade Deerfoot Trail, over a quarter billion dollars to protect communities on the Elbow River, and $166 million towards the Cancer Centre. Additionally, the Alberta government is increasing health care spending by nearly $3 billion, the education budget by nearly half a billion, and the advanced education budget by nearly $200 million compared to last year. Hundreds of millions of dollars in new investment will create 3,400 more health care training spots in post-secondaries, 100 new residency spots for doctors, and 120 new spots for physician training at Alberta universities, a 34 percent increase. Mr. Speaker, Budget 2023 represents a monumental investment in Alberta's future and only exists because of the strong fiscal management this UCP government has produced over these past years, despite COVID-19. This budget will continue to provide the affordability relief to all Albertans. Mr. Speaker, facts matter. Numbers don't lie. I would encourage all Albertans to look at all the good investments in this new Budget 2023. Don't fall for fear-mongering. The NDP would have borrowed and spent and mortgaged our children's future, while the UCP has created wealth, prosperity and jobs for future generations. Thank you, Mr. Speaker.